With over 20 million out-of-school children in Nigeria, a figure according to UNESCO, there has been an increase in theft, kidnapping, among other crimes. As she told me, she said, ma'am. A new foundation in Lagos State is helping to reduce that number by ensuring every child is entitled to at least basic education. It's a foundation we formed because we want to immortalize the ideas of my late husband, Smartoluwale Akpejue. When he was alive, he's a person who was passionate about good governance, yeah, good um, entrepreneurship, passionate about good education for people in as much as he can. He, that was what he was uh, advocating while he was alive here on earth. So we want to continue doing that, we want to immortalize him, we want it to be something that we give back to the society to help people. Organization for the purpose of helping the underprivileged, helping children that are unable to obviously fend for themselves and to afford them education and to also unprivileged women as well and children. We have started with 10 children, two who are from the school of the blind and others who simply cannot fend for, the, for themselves or their parents are not, you know, um, don't have the um, resources to fend for them. As stated in the 1999 constitution, this lawyer says education is critical to move the country forward. The power of education is that it enlightens the mind. That is why it starts with E. And it gives the development that is needed. That is the D aspect of it. Then it gives you that spirit of patriotism that will make you to respect unity. The more educated a society is, the more prosperous that society is likely to become and the more peaceful it's likely to be. For this foundation, they hope to give children opportunities to learn and become leaders to ensure a better Nigeria. Nyudua Popola, TVC News, Lagos.